Who wouldn't like to watch ducklings as they are very cute and charming? But do you know what are they eating? And do ducklings of all species eat the same food? In the beginning, one needs a little information about duckling age classes. Duckling diet is very much related to duckling age, which reflects phases of duckling feather development. Different species have different speed of development. For example, teals grow faster than mallards. Main features of the classes are that in age class 1, ducklings have only fluffy down feathers. In age class 2, ducklings are partly feathered and aged class 3 ducklings are fully feathered but flightless. All newly hatched ducklings need a lot of easily digestible proteins which they get from invertebrates. During first two weeks, animal part in duckling diet represents around 90% or even more. Downy ducklings of the blink ducks search for food on water surface. Mostly used method in this stage is pill tip level straining and pecking. Small ducklings have the highest ability to catch flying insects. They also pick insects from the vegetation and ground. One of the most general food of downy ducklings is zooplankton, especially cladoceras. From insects, ducklings like midges, mayflies, crane flies. Also flies, spiders, pond skaters, emerging or drying dragonflies. As smaller ducklings are growing, they dig deeper into the water using nostril level straining and eye level straining. In age class 2 starts to be visible first signs of specializations. Ducklings include various amounts of vegetative food into their diet. Vigion ducklings more because adults are almost herbivores and teal ducklings include less of plants because the animal part of adults is about half of their total intake. In age class 2, ducklings also become more selective for invertebrates. They include more larvas into their diet. Ducklings of doubling ducks usually stick to the shore because there is the food for them most available. Some of the food can be small per item but pechelly distributed in high densities as midges. When the patch is detected, ducklings can get a good amount of food. Already eating a good amount of plants, but still looking for some invertebrates. Of age class 2, the blink ducklings catch less insects on vegetation, ground, and uh, flying insects. They eat more larvas and aquatic invertebrates as water loose.
They are able to reach more below the water surface and include other invertebrate species into their diet. In the end of H class 2, mallard ducklings use mostly head level straining. One of the common feeding techniques of adult dabbling ducks is upending. Ducklings must train it. Adult vidunes feed mostly on plants. Ducklings switch their diet in third week almost entirely to vegetative. Similarly, get walls become since third week almost herbivores. Deals prefer smaller invertebrates. Here they can find for example quadroceras which are often abundant in duckweed. Here we can see nostril level straining. Diving ducklings use already in age class 1, few days after hatching, diving technique as the most common one. Interestingly, diet of golden eye ducklings does not very much differ from adults. Because diving ducklings catch freely swimming prey, they can feed on open water. Diving ducklings can from diving effectively get a lot of food. For example, tufted duck ducklings can on one dive successfully catch up 14 chironomids larvas. Widgeons in age class 3 have now good skills in upending foraging. They also use a lot neck and head level straining. of H class 3 are here very nicely dabbling in mud and head level straining. This is all. I hope you enjoyed the video and I wish you nice duckling watching.